we're going to take a look at a gang of Chinese hijackers who hijack usually European brands and then subsequently they post fake reviews on their items and hijack reviews as well. Here, as you can see on this uh, kid's ride-on car, all the reviews are unverified from the same person. And we can go page and page after a page. And you see Sandra has been very busy, so is Jerry. And then we got Kimberly. All of these are unverified reviews where they're just loading hundreds and hundreds of reviews. So we're going to switch from all reviews where you could see there's quite a few down to verified reviews. And this product has zero verified reviews. All of these hundreds of reviews are posted by the scammer straight up in Amazon. AI is absolutely not able to detect that or prevent it. Of course the seller is in China and all these items come with fake reviews. So let's take a look at the seller's reviews. We just looked at this ATV. Now we're going to take a look at this treadmill. There is no coincidence. Here again we get 565 ratings with the with the brand via 40 and let's scroll down to the actual reviews and we will we will see what's happening there they're all five star aren't they oh looks like same Sandra being really busy there now we are switching to most recent and you could see they are all loaded in recent days by hundreds and hundreds. Switching now to the reviews by recency, so we're sorting them by when the reviews are posted. See all May 20th and take a look at the verified reviews and of course there's zero. 500 plus reviews posted by the seller themselves. None of these reviews is real. That's definitely, again, European sounding brand where this particular Chinese seller is posting their listings and then stuffing them with fake reviews. I thought that Amazon would be able to detect those things, but apparently they're not. The only reviews that you see would be then either fake, hijacked or negative reviews. Now we're going to take a look at this third brand where we're looking at this adjustable bed frame that's yet a different brand. You could see European sounding brand. We'll get to the brands later because they are all being intertwine because this particular hijacker is hijacking European brands registering them in United States now we're going by again by date and Albert seems to have been very busy posting one review after another now these are quite old so Amazon is not detecting April, April 27th reviews this is being report recorded two months later so these have stayed there for a good two months. Now we're going to take a look on this one. There are some verified reviews and we're going to analyze those. So looking at the verified reviews, they will be coming from different products. So let's take a look. We're talking about something that's definitely not a bed, a folding bed. 
so we're going to take a look and search for the product that this review is for clicking on the review you can see that this is not a folding bed in the web address we're going to delete everything after the reviewer review and right here on the top right hand corner you see where that where those reviews are hijacked from they're hijacked from a desk power cord with a grommet and so if the reviews are not just blatantly fake they are hijacked now note this brand Mars Vogel so doing a search who registered that brand or is in process of registering it in um, United States it's this fellow who's registered a whole bunch of other brands he's located in China and they all sound European so this song person located in China has registered all these brands in October last year so we're now taking a look at that Italian brand locating it on Amazon again with thousands of reviews so for Papadretti brand so let's take a look going down to for Papadretti vacuum portable vacuum reviews and oh boy they're all five star again so let's sort sort them by most recent oh Kimberly doesn't she sound familiar and all these are again unverified reviews and Kimberly has been putting in a few dozen and then Rebecca and Jeremy took over and again they're all posted June 20th couple days ago and now we're just going and sorting them reviews by the date and paging through all names in caps I mean if the Chinese tried to disguise it l at least a little bit but apparently they're using a computer program to generate th those reviews are copied from something else and then just blatantly posted on the listing none of these reviews are verified so they are just posted there by the Chinese seller to mislead the Amazon customers into thinking this particular product has hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of reviews just going through a few pages to illustrate the amazing quantity they're able to put in without Amazon system being um, able to detect them this is you know going ju down to June 19 they started on June 20th oh, ben Benjamin you could at least vary the names but we're now going to see verified reviews because we do have some verified reviews and we will find where those verified reviews came from usually there's a handful of real ones once the product sells of course there might be already customers posting the reviews and we're just going a little bit farther in time so we would get to international reviews so here is where that comes from so we're going to put this international review supposedly coming from cordless vacuum cleaner and we're going to put it in a search engine and that will that will help us locate where that the real product where that review came from so here is one in Italian and we've, I've already pre-searched for it and here's exactly the same verbiage in Italian same date and same reviewer and it's coming from Propedretti Acai Acid da stiro naturale which is here's the Fro Fropedretti brand and um, it was hijacked from a clothes hanger so then we're gonna look at next brand that these people quote unquote have registered from China and 
Kauf is another German brand. So another cordless vacuum, supposedly Kauf brand. And it's the same story over and over again. We're going to go to the verified and unverified reviews, find the international one, and the international review comes from Kauf, which is a real German brand, and this is a, a mini first aid kit. And then going to the first kit, first aid kit reviews, we will find that in there, in German, is exactly the same verbiage. So the Chinese hijacker is using the same brand and that lets them hijack reviews from unrelated product that's the same brand. If I'm going too fast, I'm just trying to make this video as short as possible because it's, it's pretty long to begin with. Um, this is done for the evidence so we can uh, submit this to FTC and USPTO showing the misuse and abuse of, of brand registry on Amazon as well as you know hacking the Amazon and taking this to Federal Trade Commission and Amazon teams that investigate these issues. So just going back through the fake reviews you see that we've now seen several brands they're all European and across a couple of sellers and they have the same modus operandi they are just uploading their own reviews and after they're done uploading their own unverified reviews then they would hijack reviews from the real brands that are usually European brands that unfortunately didn't register their trademark in the United States so this these hackers then abuse the brand. Now we're going to same again same fellow in China registered a big tech brand. Big tech here's a Wi-Fi extender supposedly a big tech brand with a few thousand reviews and selling quite well customers trust reviews and so this must be terrific product right with so many great reviews scrolling down to international reviews so we're, we're going to search for this review search is done through Google and we did find it and that's exactly the same verbiage and now we're gonna scroll up and show where that's hijacked from so you see the Wi-Fi extender hijacked this from the German product that has the real big tech brand and that is how they are able to grab thousands and thousands of reviews from real brands through this Amazon loophole back end so of course you know once you see a real review verified reviews they're usually disappointed customers or a lot of them disappointed customers now this one is just sorted by the date so we can illustrate again how this quote unquote big tech brand is um, uploading same fake reviews as the previous five brands we were talking about and the real reviews are then hijacked from a big tech German items we're gonna go over one more big tech item um, just to show the scope of what's going on here I'm just going through a bunch of pages on this Wi-Fi um, extended the white one to make sure that we show the enormous vastness of this review fraud and the fact that Amazon is not detecting it 
We're going to try to report this to Amazon, but it's like whack-a-mole game. If the Amazon people don't have an AI that could detect this, you know, the Chinese are switching these reviews from one product to another, trying to evade detection. So it, it's really hard doing something like this manually because at the moment um, we're aware of, of at least a couple thousand, if not more, of uh, brands that are using black hat techniques to market, quote unquote, their items on Amazon through through this method. Now I'm just um, going into the Wi-Fi extenders seller because it's, you know, usually these hackers have multiple selling accounts. So when one seller gets terminated, they just start selling it through another. So here's our Chinese fellow seller. And we're going to take a look at the assortment of products they carry. And here you can see that they have more than one Wi-Fi extender. They're all big tech brand. And again, the same story repeats itself. Thousands of reviews. And sorting the reviews by the most recent one. So we're seeing the negative review. And then the fake reviews with the capitalized first name. Unverified reviews page after page after page after page. So I think we've made our point on this one, didn't we? Now we're going to the top reviews from other countries. So this is the section where there are verified reviews and now uh, we're going to locate where those verified reviews by Wi-Fi extender were hijacked from. So we got over 2,500 reviews on this white Wi-Fi extender and we're going to find where they are hijacked from. We've already seen the 2,500 reviews. Now we're going to the 3,000 plus reviews. And, you know, this seller has dozens of products under the brand. So if one product gets terminated, they just upload another one. So here's a big tech black color extender with thousands of reviews and it's Amazon Choice. Amazon AI automatically awards a choice, Amazon's choice, recommending this to Amazon customers. When the product has a whole bunch of five-star reviews and lots of them. And so the Chinese are taking care, taking uh, good advantage of it. So the whole Amazon system is absolutely unreliable and misleading. So on this black Wi-Fi extender, we located the review and cross-referencing it to the same orange Big Tech one. And right there, is, you can see that it's that same review. So the Chinese hijackers have the ability to if it's the same brand, to attach that same foreign review to several of their products. So here you see the white um, Wi-Fi range, range extender and a same review is attached to it as to the black one. So they, they have, see that's the real German item and that review is attached to the black one and the white range range extender and of course the black one is amazon choice amazon is wholeheartedly recommending these scam products to poor unsuspecting amazon customers so just going into the sorting these reviews by chronological and even the black one of course has all them capital letters, first name, unverified reviews by hundreds. So 
So, unfortunately, if you're shopping on Amazon, Amazon will recommend you product that is completely black hat. And, you know, if these people are taking advantage of the Amazon system, this is the European brands that this particular seller sells. And most of them are hijacked. It's a brand that exists in Europe and it's successful. And they would be listings on Amazon Germany and Amazon Italy. And then the uh, Chinese register the brand name here in the United States if it's not registered. And that's what gives them the ability to hijacked European listings reviews and um, Amazon so far is powerless so we're gonna keep an eye on these brands and see where that leads there is a way that you know um, the brands could raise an issue with USPTO because all these brands are still in progress of being registered by USPTO so um, you know, 14,000 hijacked reviews. That's just completely ridiculous. That one is another emergency kit by the real German manufacturer, Kauf. And if you scroll down through this seller's listing, it's really hundreds and hundreds. Just um, incredibly amazing the quantity of fraud that the Chinese perpetrate. You know, there's 150 pages on this just one brand. And uh, they have several brands that they're hijacking this way. So we're just going through specific brands. This is supposed to be a telescope. And I'm sure that in the near future, this will become a telescope with this particular brand, which will have a bunch of hijacked reviews from that brand where it exists in uh, Europe. I've already seen some of the reviews. They're starting to launch the uh, Wi-Fi thermometer and uh, some of these reviews by those all caps uh, fake people already talked about 